All right, this is, let's see if I can find it right here. This is grade four, module four, lesson two. And in this lesson, we are going to be learning about right angles and whether angles are greater than or less than right angles. And, and really the proper names is right angle, obtuse, and acute angle. So we're gonna learn about all the different types of angles in, in this lesson. And let's get going on this. So the first thing I want to show you here is this little applet that I wrote a long time ago. And basically, we've got an angle right here. And I'm going to zoom in a little bit here. All right, there we go. And I've got an angle. It's kind of a run-of-the-mill angle. And you'll notice it's angle CAB. Or I could call it angle BAC. So my choice, right? Uh, as long as the A is in the middle because it's the vertex, it's the corner. So I've got this angle, and I can move it, and I can move it around, and I can turn it kind of a tiny little angle like this, or I can turn it into a big old fat angle. I can even go further around, and as I'm doing this, you'll notice that the angle is changing, the number of degrees is changing, and you'll notice the name is changing. So when I'm a small angle, it's called an acute angle, and when it's a bigger angle, it's called an obtuse angle. And now the idea is, when is when? You know, when is which angle? Well, when is the name acute and when is it obtuse? So you'll notice all of these are acute. And then as I go, you'll watch this, watch this. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Right there, ah, right at 90 degrees. All of a sudden it's called a right angle and that's the sharp 90 degree angle right here kind of like a door right at a door or the corner of a book and we indicate it with a, a square instead of an angle arc instead of an arc all of a sudden it becomes whoa where is it ah, there a square and then if it goes bigger than 90 oh, all of a sudden it's called an obtuse angle so the thing I want you to learn is if it's less than 90 degrees, it's acute. If it's greater than 90 degrees, it's obtuse. And if it's exactly 90 degrees, oh, I'm so close. Can I do it? Oh, 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 oh. If I'm, oh, 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 no, no. If I'm exactly 90 degrees, how do I do it? Oh, 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 there. If it's exactly 90 degrees, then it's called a right angle. So let's put this into some practice here real quick. Um, so let's identify these. This angle, is it acute or obtuse? Oh, well, it's acute, which means it is less than 90 degrees. How about this angle right here? Well, it's obtuse because it is greater than 90 degrees. And then let's do one last one right here, this angle right here. Well, this is acute because it is less than 90 degrees. And that is, oops, I'm going to zoom out of here. That is grade four, module four, lesson two, where we're learning about right angle, obtuse angle, and acute angle.